PDF files are common resources made available to students, but it's really important to make sure that the PDF files are actually accessible to disabled students as well. There's a very quick check that you can do that will help you determine whether your PDF is accessible or not. Here is a scanned document and I've opened it up in Adobe Reader. With my usual selection tool, if I can only select boxes or the whole page, that is not an accessible PDF. However, if when I select the page we have the text being selected instead, that is an accessible PDF. We can double check this as well by selecting the text and copying it. We can open up something like Notepad, paste the text in, and you can see here that the text that we've copied is the same as the text on the PDF. Having an accessible PDF also allows the students to highlight and annotate their documents better by using the tools available within Adobe Reader. You can't do that with a non-accessible PDF. There are many programs out there that will convert your standard images, your scans, into text-based PDFs. One of them is called PDF Converter. And basically what it does is it takes the scanned image and it looks for the text characters and then puts a layer underneath the image which can be selected and that's the text that we've just been looking at there. So just a reminder, any PDF that you upload and make available to students needs to be accessible to disabled students. Double check it and if it's not accessible, use a program like PDF Converter to save it as a searchable PDF.